I'm here with the NECW television champion, Johnny Thunder, who is set to defend his title against an NECW legend, Johnny Idol. A tale of two Johnnies, a battle of two Johnnies for the NECW television championship. Johnny Idol, I sat back and I watched you take on Antonio Thomas. And you know what? You took it to the champ. I have a lot of respect for you. Whenever you work Antonio Thomas, you know you're getting worked to your fullest. You know, so with all that respect and all that aside, now let's talk about the television championship, which is currently around my waist and where it will currently stay around my waist. I have no intention on dropping the title to you. With all due respect, you're a great worker and you've been around a long time, probably as long as I have. But the fact of the matter is this, I'm the champion. You have to beat me. And John Adel, tonight, it's not going to happen for you. Johnny Thunder and Johnny Idol for the NECW Television Championship. Standing here with an NECW legend, the egomaniac Johnny Idol, as he gets set to face the NECW television champion, Johnny Thunder. Now, Johnny, it's your second match back in NECW, and it's your second title shot. Well, yeah. Are you surprised by that, really? No. No. All right. Very good. I, by the way, I like your I like your choice in colors. It's very good. Purple. Guy's smart. Look, if you know your history in NECW, you'll know that back in September of 2005. I won that television championship, but I held it proudly for six months. That title meant a whole lot to me, and it means a whole lot to me now. In fact, it might even mean more to me now than it did then. Just a few weeks ago, I came back here, and I had what I thought was a very tough match, a very good match against the NECW champion, Antonio Thomas. I didn't come up with the win, but the powers that be here at NECW, they, uh, they thought I had a good enough showing where they felt like I should deserve a a title shot against Johnny Thunder. And why not? I mean, let's face it, I am the egomaniac Johnny Otto, right? I am, right? 
All right, good. Good man. This guy's all right. Johnny Thunder, I don't know all that much about you, but I do know this much. I've done a little bit of homework on you, and I found you've been around a long time. I also found out that uh, you're not you're not above going going to some dirty tactics when it when it when it calls for it. You know. <laughs> I'll tell you this, Johnny Thunder, that much you and I have in common. And if you know anything about me at all, you know that I'm going to come at you with everything I have. I don't love anything more than a good fight. Hope you're ready for it, buddy, because I know I am. I'm looking forward to it. Johnny Idol looking to once again hold the NECW Television Championship. Interesting comments from Johnny Idol as he makes his return to the England Championship Wrestling. Folks, this coming Saturday night, Beverly, Massachusetts, Clash of the Cove. You do not want to miss this, a tremendous card on tap. NECW Heavyweight Champion Antonio Thomas taking on Sean Burke, the former champion. Slick Wagner Brown taking on Bobby Ocean. And so much more. We'll have a whole rundown for you later in this broadcast. As Johnny Idol has the advantage right now over Johnny Thunder. Thunder driven into the corner. Once again, Thunder taking some shots to that already damaged left arm and shoulder. Very smartly working that arm and shoulder in the ropes. Referee Chris Bartolo telling Idol to break it. Idol goes thunder down, gets a one count. Nice hammerlock into a pinning combination by Idol, who goes back to the hammerlock. Thunder face down, Isle with the leverage position. Tough spot for Johnny Thunder to be in right now. He's getting that weak point worked over. Thunder with a shot to the midsection. Idle leaving himself open. And Idle with a back elbow sends Thunder straight back down to the canvas. Idle goes for the cover but only gets two. Once again, Thunder back to the arm. You can see by the expression on Thunder's face that uh, he's feeling some pain from that arm bar. Fans behind Johnny Thunder. And Idol went for the shot, but Thunder cut him off. Thunder does it again, but Idol slugfest right here. These guys are hammering at each other. And Thunder wins the slugfest. Idol down to the canvas and again. Thunder with a big shot. Johnny Thunder with the advantage here. Off the ropes goes Idol, and Thunder with a spin kick levels the challenger, goes for the cover right here, hooks the leg, but only gets two. Fans, I can't stress enough, you want to be in Beverly, Massachusetts, Saturday night. Johnny Thunder will be on that card. Once again, we will have more details on all the matches coming up a little bit later. And now it's Idle laying in wait for Johnny Thunder. DDT sends Thunder head first into the canvas. Thunder looks like he's out of it. Idle with a cover. This could do it, but Thunder rolls the shoulder. Fans uh, providing a little color commentary here. Idol signaling for the pile driver. Idol has put many an opponent away with the pile driver over the years. Idol can't seem to get Thunder up as he pounds away across the back. Idol tries for it again. 
Once again, Thunder won't go. Thunder rolls him over. Pinning combination right here. And there's a three count. Let's get the official word. In your winner of the match, and still the NECW television champion, Johnny Thunder. Johnny Thunder with a victory over the egomaniac Johnny Idol in a battle of two legends. Idol looking at Thunder right now. Idol extends the hand. Show of respect between two great talents. The NEC oh, wait a minute. From behind, it's Burke and Ocean. Sean Burke and Bobby Ocean attacking. Thunder and Idol. What the hell's going on here? We've got to take a break. We'll sort this out when we come back. The official printing company of New England Championship Wrestling is Color Copy Center Boston. We copy, we print, we bind, we laminate. And we offer free delivery in Metro Boston. See us at 31 St. James Avenue in the Park Square Building. Call us at 617-391-0030 or visit us online at colorcopycenterboston.com. They make NECW look good, they'll make you look good too. Ocean trying to make some kind of a statement here. Hey, hey, it's like we were saying, out with the old and in with the new. Oh, wait a minute. Here comes the NECW champion, Antonio Thomas, Slick Wagner Brown, going to town on Birkin Ocean. We've got a little preview here of what's going to take place this Saturday night. Wagner Brown on the outside. It is all broken down out here. Antonio Thomas. Right in the face of Bobby Ocean. And speaking of faces, Slick Wagner Brown stretching out the face of Sean Burke. Referee Barbara Mahoney trying to get some order here. Burke face first into that merchandise table. Thomas and Bobby Ocean on the outside. Wagner with Burke right into the sound table, the timekeeper's table. Weeks ago, we saw Sean Burke and Bobby Ocean perpetrate a vicious attack on Wagner Brown and Antonio Thomas, the NECW heavyweight champion. and Ocean on the outside. Burke firing away on Slick Wagner Brown. Thomas with a big chop on Ocean. Officials trying to get some order here, trying to let these guys get it out of their system. Get security! This situation is totally broken down. And Thomas driven into the ring post. Might have injured his hand right there. This is a totally impromptu situation. It was Johnny Thunder and Johnny Idol having a match when Burke and Ocean hit the ring. Wagner Brown and Antonio Thomas came out to break things up, and now we've got an impromptu tag match. Wagner off the ropes, Burke with a back elbow. Antonio Thomas ready to come into the ring. Referee Chris Bartolo initiating this situation, which I believe to be an unsanctioned impromptu match. Sean Burke, the former NECW heavyweight champion, making a shocking return after six months off due to a broken ankle. It took place in a match with Antonio the Promised Thomas. 
for the NECW Heavyweight Championship. Burke relinquished the title, and Thomas won the belt from there in a top contenders match between himself and Johnny Thunder. Burke now blames Thomas for the injury, and he is back for revenge. But right now, Slick Wagner Brown is getting pounded on by the former champion, who goes for the cover and only gets one. Saturday night, Slick Wagner Brown faces Bobby Ocean, his former best friend. And Sean Burke attempts to win back the NECW Heavyweight Championship, a title he never lost in the ring. Slick Wagner Brown getting worked over in the corner. Wagner Brown, a former NECW Heavyweight Champion. With a blatant choke. What a situation this is. Burke and Ocean accusing Wagner Brown and Antonio Thomas of holding them and other younger talents down as Wagner Brown delivers a big drop kick. Come on, Wagner makes a tag. Here comes Antonio Thomas. And Burke heads for the tall timber. Ocean sent in the hard way. Thomas fires away on Ocean. Thomas has Ocean on the run. Jabbing away at Bobby Ocean. Thomas telling Burke, this is for you. Antonio Thomas, more heated than I've ever seen him. Ocean sent head first into the turnbuckle. Big chop by Thomas. A blistering chop by Antonio, the promised Thomas. Set to the opposite side. Thomas now charging in with a forearm. Thomas once again charging in. Thomas with a far more aggressive style than we're accustomed to seeing him. Oh, slap right in the face of Ocean. Suplex into a bridge. Cover right here, but only two. Sean Burke saved the day for Bobby Ocean. And now Slick Wagner Brown attacking Sean Burke. Sending Burke all the way to the outside. And Wagner Brown follows him out. SWB setting up Sean Burke on the outside, has him by the leg. He's going to slingshot him into that wall, into that speaker. And there goes Burke. Ocean and Thomas on the outside. Wagner Brown now with a chair. Drops it on top of the former champion, Sean Burke. Thomas now sending Ocean into the kitchen the hard way. What a wild situation this has turned into. Thomas and Ocean on the outside. Wagner and Burke on the outside. Wagner Brown working over Sean Burke. Antonio Thomas breaking the face of Bobby Ocean. Thomas firing away at the midsection of Ocean, while Wagner, a full body slam on Sean Burke on the outside. I don't believe this was ever a sanctioned match, or whatever it was, it is totally broken down now. Looks like he doesn't get his way 
Sending. In the hard way, as does Thomas with Ocean. Brown and Thomas backing off here. I think it's a little too late for apologies. Thomas and Wagner charge in, but Burke and Ocean head for the tall timber. Burke and Ocean have had enough. Staff and officials trying to keep these men apart. You see yours truly, Paul Richard, general manager, trying to get this situation under control. We're trying to get in my face. That's not going to get him very far. Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on, brother. What a preview of this coming Saturday night. Thomas versus Burke. Sleek Wagner Brown versus Bobby Ocean. We will run down all of Saturday night's card for you in just a few moments, but this is just a taste of what you're going to see. As we continue to try to get this situation under control, we'll bring you comments from Sean Burke and the NECW Heavyweight Champion Antonio Thomas when New England Championship Wrestling continues after this. New England Championship Wrestling returns live with Clash at the Cove, Saturday night, August 3rd, at the Cove Community Center, 19 East Corning Street, Beverly, Mass., with a 7 p.m. bell time. In the main event, NECW Heavyweight Champion Antonio The Promise Thomas faces former champion Sean Burke. Slick Wagner Brown battles former best friend Bobby Ocean, plus new NECW Tag Team Champions Webin Fahrenheit, NECW Television Champion Johnny Thunder, and much more to be announced. Tickets on sale now at NECW.TV or call 1-800-838-3006. That's 1-800-838-3006. New England Championship Wrestling, Clash at the Cove, Saturday night, August 3rd in Beverly. Don't miss it. Sean, can I get a moment of your time? What the hell are you doing back? Come on. Didn't I tell you to shut up before? Yeah, but what about August 3rd, what about Beverly August Mass? 3rd? What's going to happen on August 3rd? Do you know? You're facing Antonio the Promised Thomas for what you're claiming is your NECW Heavyweight Championship? There's something you just said there that doesn't really sit right with me. That I'm claiming to be the NECW Heavyweight Champion? Well, Antonio is the champion. Oh, Antonio is the champion. Did he beat me? Did he beat me? No, he didn't beat me. He broke my ankle. Okay? He didn't beat me. Nobody beat me. No one's ever beat me here. You got something else to ask me? Well, is this just about the championship or is this something a little deeper, more personal? The man claimed to be my friend. Personally, I never really cared about that. All I cared about was the championship. All I cared about was glory and money. The NECW Heavyweight Championship brings both. Antonio Thomas is now just a stepping stone. He might think it's personal. Wagner Brown might think this is personal. I don't care about either of them. I got my eye on the prize. But you're right, August 3rd? Cove Community Center, Beverly, Mass. What's this? An eight ball? Eight ball. Antonio Thomas' title reign? Short-lived. Eight ball, corner pocket. See ya! New England Championship Wrestling returns to action on Saturday night, August the 3rd, with a 7 p.m. bell time. The NECW Heavyweight Champion, Antonio the Promised Thomas, is set to defend his title against Sean Burke. You know, Al, I never thought that it would come to this. I thought I knew Sean Burke. I thought we were best friends. I thought we were colleagues. I thought we were peers. I thought we were, we were like brothers. I stood up for him at his wedding. I've been there in the hardest of times. And what he did to me upon his return, I still can't come to grips with it. I, honestly, I don't, I'm really at a loss for words. You know, back 
on December 6, 2012, when Sean Burke broke his ankle. It was a charity event, and Sean had an open challenge. The promoter asked him, who do you want to defend the title against? And Sean Burke chose me. He said, I want the best. I want a man that knows me better than anybody else. And I told him going into that match, I said, Sean, we don't have to do this. I said, we don't have to. <laughs> I said, Sean, we don't have to do this. But he insisted. And that night he broke his ankle, put him out of action for six months. And apparently, he has a little bit of revisionist history. And now he's saying that I broke his ankle. He starts to question my motives in bringing him into this business and helping him get to where he was, to where he is, where he wants to be. Saying I'm selfish. Saying that I broke his ankle. I didn't deliberately break your ankle. I didn't even break it. That's part of the game. You had bad luck. I never deliberately hurt anybody. But on August 3rd, Burke, I'm going to have to deliberately hurt you if that's what it comes to. Because August 3rd, you wanted it, you got it. You want to call me a phony? You want to call me a fake? <laughs> August 3rd, you're going to see that I'm all real. August 3rd, you're going to meet your maker. You step into the promised land. This isn't a training session. This isn't a videotape session. This isn't hanging out, having a few beers, watching a game. This isn't like old times. This is now. You asked for it, Burke. You got it. Ever since you came back, you've been running your mouth. August 3rd, I'm going to shut it. Bring the best you got. Bring everything you have. Because I'm telling you, it ain't going to be good enough. You come for this. You come for the title you say is yours and that you never lost. You come get it, Sean. Because you want me to beat you for the title I never beat you for. I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it August 3rd. And I'm going to do it in dominant fashion. And I'm going to shut you up once and for all. It had to come to this. Oh, well. Let it. August 3rd. Come on, Burke. You're going down. That is a promise.